Okay, guys, we're gonna get another quickie. How are you guys doing today? Who's jealous of your talents? Whomever this is is jealous of your talents. This could be on the internet, sleeping with a friend. Someone is sleeping with a friend of yours. I hope you guys are all being blessed today. Let no harm or danger come towards any and everyone in the mighty name of Jesus. Lustful. Someone is just downright lustful. This could be the person you're dealing with or the person that they're dealing with or just someone around you. Sleeping with most definitely. Somebody is sleeping with the friend. I don't know who this is. Y'all need to figure it out. Because I don't know who it could be. No, 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 no. Shut it. Shut it. Get that off of there and go throw that away. You better not stick that gum anywhere. Tarot reader, that's a thief. Sleeping with you. I'm sure a tarot reader isn't your friend. Y'all may communicate and social associate with one another due to readings or whatever. Fake gangster. Someone's a fake gangster. And they're childish. Whomever these people are trying to take your looks. Like, what I'm getting here is Someone sleeping with your friend and like they're doing it on purpose or they could be around in your community. This is someone that you used to that you used to be with. They're a two timer. And a hypocrite. Hypocrites, not a nice person. This person may come off as oh, I'm so sweet. Oh, I'm so cool. Oh, I'm a good person. Oh, but they're not not a nice person. This keep coming out. Hate your sex. Ooh, someone hates your sex. Someone is mad because <laughs> what I'm getting, if you haven't even ever slept with this person or whatever, or you have or whatever they're mad because you won't give them any sex and they're not a nice person like they're coming off as this mean cool person they try to act all big and bad like like they really from the slums or from the streets and they're really just a faker and they're childish they are a two-timer they will two-time you at any given moment a tarot reader, they could have this tarot reader stealing from you, or this tarot reader could be stealing from you on their own, trying to pretend they're all big and bad, like, yeah, I took your shit, now what? Or whatever, trying to act, that's what I'm getting, like, um, and I'll take your man, too, I'll take whoever you're, you know, I took your man, and I'll, I'll you know, they're trying to play gangsta, all gangsta on the net net. But it's really just child's play. Like, it's hella childish. Like, this person is a two-timer. They're a karmic feminine is what came out as well. Stop talking so much. Like, someone is saying, and it's an Aries that have something to do with it. Well, they're saying, like, you know, if you don't shut up, uh... I'm going to take your man, you know, they're trying to play like they're bad and that they'll do something to you on the internet or whatever, um, you know, or they act like they took this person from you and 
you know, that, you know, they can take what belongs to you and that, you know, they're, they're a tarot reader because they feel full of drama. They're just full of drama, all of them. They're fake wannabes on the net net and it's not even real because they're dealing with the mental illness and they're stealing from their job. This person either got fired from their job, they're stealing from their job, could be a cancer involved, or whatever. Someone thought they stole a cancer from you. Uh, it could have been a tarot reader that's trying to pretend like they're big and bad and like they're about that life with you and they're not. And they could have been thinking that they were getting all this money from these readings and from the internet and from you know, whatever work that they're doing on the internet, but they're going to end up with no coins from trying to mess around with you because they needed to heal from rape. They're really not a nice person. They come off and, oh, yeah, girl, I'm this, I'm that. And, you know, um, I love y'all. I want the best for y'all or whatever, but um, it's really just, um, them pretending to get what they want because they're narcissistic. This person really on the, their spirit, man, is not good. And they're a really selfish person. Like, they're not going to help anyone. Tarot reader stealing your work. It's this tarot reader. And they feel as though, you know, you're talking too much. Like, you're taking their job. You talk too much. Two-timer. Ooh, this came out twice, so... You really are dealing with a two-timer. And this could be a tarot reader that's a two-timer. This could be a tarot reader that's a hypocrite. Try to front on the front street about, oh, it's got this. Oh, it's about my people. I'm helping my people. I love my people. I'm doing this for the people. I'm doing this for humanity. I'm doing this to raise the vibration. But it's all really just about themselves or whatever, they want someone to hate you and your sex, and they could be doing spell work to make this person hate you, using you as an option to make someone else jealous. Someone use you as an option to make someone else jealous. A tarot reader is big time really, really stealing, or whatever, from your channel. They're dealing with mental illness. He's jealous of your talents. Someone is jealous of your talents. Could be a Pisces, an Aries. A, uh, Pisces. Third party prostitute. This person is a third party prostitute. Like anyone that they get with, they are always like the third wheel and they just prostitute. Like they're really sleeping with this person for money. Or whatever, whomever this person is that they're dealing with, they always end up being the third wheel and they sleep with this person for money. Either they're giving this person money or this person get money from them. It could be a Virgo. They're two-faced, whoever this is. They go back running, like telling, you know, if they're sleeping with your friend, they're talking about uh, both of y'all and this person like... You talk too much. It's all of them and their family. It could be an ex that's dealing with the new person you're dealing with. Or the new person could be dealing with someone that, that's re related to the ex that you used to be with. They all just got mental illnesses. They're really cheaters. That's why they want you to shut up. A Scorpio is involved with this. A cheating Scorpio. They're a three-timer. Like, it's instead of it being two people, it's like three people. These people got three people in different cities with different area codes, with different booties, with fake booties, real booties, narrow booties, little booties, big booties, big boobs, hanging boobs, long boobs. And it's nothing to do with anything but sex. Want you... For a place to live. Someone just wants you to come in and live with you. Because they don't have anywhere else to go. Or they're getting ready to get put out. So they want to use you as a place. A scapegoat. Backstabbing partner. This partner is a backstabber. 
they backstab everyone that they come in contact with is what I'm hearing. It just have to be family, friends, whomever. They backstab everyone and especially ones they sleep with because they just be wanting sex and money or whatever will rob you. This person will rob you. They backstab you every chance they get. They want you to lose your job. Whatever you're doing, they want you to lose it, want to use you for money. Someone wants to want you to lose your job, not only lose your job. If you got a business or whatever, they want it to stop and they want um, to use you for money. How can you want my job to be taken away plus want me for money? That's crazy. This What I'm getting is this person emotions be all mixed up all over the place, but they're all for their sex thing. And they're fake. They are a fake gangster. They run around here robbing people, stealing, killing, destroying, lying, cheating, belittle, body shaming. It could be a cancer or whatever. They, they feel that as though they robbed you. A Libra is involved. They These people are closet smokers. They may look like they're all put together and they're well established, but they do drugs. This person is not your twin. So if you were thinking it was, it's not. You got the smoke or whatever. They don't. Talking behind your back came in reverse. So whatever this person was trying to conjure up and try to stay behind your back, it's not working. Because people are seeing it for what it really is. You're a winner. And someone don't like to bathe. And it fell in reverse. Cousin sleeping with your partner. Whoever this is. This could be present, uh, past, present, and future. Someone is going to sleep with your partner. Or they already have. You know, this is something that they want to do. Or they've been doing. A Libra is involved with this. I keep telling y'all, full of drama. These people are full of drama. Move away from them. Shut the door on them so they can start receiving their just due. They just do want your car to be broke. Whomever this is, you could have had a wreck. And someone wants your car to be messed up where you can't move. They want you in a stagnated place, a stuck, sunken place. Risk taker. This person risked their life, risked their body, risked their health, risked whatever they have to risk to get whatever they want. Divine feminine. This is not your homeboy and they're a pervert. You talk too much. This person feels that you talk too much. Whole town hating on you. You got a, a whole lot of people hating on you in your city or whatever. Um, they could know that you've been, if you've been sneaking around with a, a sneaky link, they could know about it, will rob you. Whomever these people are, they will rob you. They're gossiping and spreading rumors. Fake tarot card reader. It's a fake tarot card reader that's going through your information, trying to figure out everything about you so she can... Try to pretend as though she's you. They're fair out jealous. Someone is a closet smoker and they're just fair out jealous. Like, it's no returning for the jealousy that is, the jealousy is real. Baby daddy no good. Like, your baby daddy is no good. They are jealous. Could be jealous of you. Could be talking the slandering you down to the ground. Slandering your name down or whatever. Um, fake tarot readers stealing your work. He like young men. So someone is bisexual or whatever and they're jealous of you. This could be the person. The, the reason for why this person could also hate your sex or any woman's sex is because they like men. It could be to do with the cancer. Or the person they're sleeping with is a cancer. And it's another man. Cormac Feminine will use you for money. They're a hobosexual. Like, they just go from place to place. 
all over the internet introducing themselves to people getting in people's pants getting in people's information just to use them for money someone to live food car everything and they're gonna go move on to the next one once after they see that you don't have the necessary items that they are looking for for them to mooch they're on to the next one they will use you for money high credit score we're gonna have a higher credit score because they keep coming out who wants to take credit for your work someone wants to take credit for your work drug user whomever this person is is a drug user this person made you an optional because they're a hater or it's people around them cause them to make you an option because they were a hater ex lover is a hater sent bad energy this person did send bad energy to you could have sent it to your car your home your finances where you go eat at i mean what you're trying to pursue what you're trying to do it could feel stagnated because this person did send bad energy towards you wish them well Still wish them well because they're just lustful and they don't want to heal their childhood wounds. They could be going to fake tarot readers. Don't like kids. This person really don't like kids. They're too much of a sex addict. So they're not thinking about no kids. Friends slept with your mate. Whoever this person is slept with your mate and they were a friend to you. Catfish stalker. Someone is catfish stalking you, like trying to make themselves look like you, present themselves as you, do what you do on the internet. It has something to do with the Gemini. Someone is a drug dealer. This is not your home, girl. And whomever this is, their credit score is low. Or your credit score could be low right now, but it's going to be high. Calling you broke, whomever these people were, they were calling you broke. And you're just going to be sitting in a puddle and a whole bunch of money. Smoking meth, whomever it is watching you as well. They could like to go both ways. If they're a woman, they like other women. If they're a man, they like other men. Because they're full of lust and sexual addictions. And they don't love for real. And they're a karmic divine fam. So we don't know who this who really cat is, but all we can say is she got to get it together. Whether she's karmic or not, get it together. Get it together. Yeah, this is crazy. These people will be using drugs in the closet. They could look all good and be dressed all nice and have money and still be an addict and be jealous of other people and what other people are doing because they don't know how to love themselves. They are just... Spinning around that corner wheel, working around trying to convince the public that there's someone that they're not. That's the only thing they got going on right, you know, right here. Trying to use you for options, lying, stealing, cheating, creating drama, going back and forth disguising themselves not even really showing you who they are they're perverts they like kids they need to one night stand them to come out that this is a person that is a pervert they like one night stands they will stick they wanky wanky in anything and not give a care or concern and wake up the next day and be like oh what happened if that she is on fire? They ain't gonna even know what to do. 
what happened? What did I do? And they, like, they were out of their head just thinking about sex or whatever. Like, thinking that sex was everything. And they could never get comfortable with just one person. They had to always be messing around with a lot of different suitors or whatever. Getting whatever they can get out of them. Could be a Virgo and a Scorpio that's involved. Aries, Gemini. Like, it's crazy. They backstab people. Like, just on the strength. Because they know they're not worth anything. They be trying to pretend all uh, in other people's face. Like, they're just this big time gangster. And they're not. They are not. 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 says no never discourage anyone who continually make progress no matter how slow I'm trying to be better than yesterday she's happy and sad and she wonders how that could be okay What message? Oh, oh. what message do you have for us? What message is for us? I'm going to take this one. Today I wake with joy, expecting but the happy things of God to come to me. I will... God's will for me is perfect and happiness. Okay, guys. Bye. I hope you guys all have a blessed day. If you don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel, would appreciate it. God bless. Bye.